Maury High School students greeted by messages of hate. Norfolk school officials discovered the racist and anti-Semitic graffiti this morning and quickly reacted. Ten on your side's Melanie Woodrow spoke with one rabbi all too familiar with spray-painted messages. Melanie. Stephanie, two and a half years ago, similar messages were painted outside of Temple Bethel in Norfolk. The latest graffiti outside Moray comes on the first night of the Jewish religious holiday, Hanukkah. Norfolk police and school officials quickly covered the messages of hate this morning. It just continues to sadden me that this is something that had happened two and a half years ago in this community. Susan Tendler is rabbi at Temple Beth El. The synagogue across the street from Maury High School was targeted in the past. And whether it's here or across the street at a high school, school is also a place where children spend a great deal of their hours in a given week. It should feel like a second home. That home was desecrated sometime overnight. Well, it makes them feel unsafe, insecure, belittled, targeted, different, hated, and filled with negative images that are never okay. Students like Kionda Andrews were disappointed but not surprised. You can't do anything about it. Pretty much can't. So it's going to happen anyways regardless. Well, some parents wished they could shield their children from such negativity. It's not good. <laughs> I didn't even want to tell my son about it because I know he wouldn't know about it, you know. By 9.30 a.m., school officials removed the messages. Anticipating the damage was already done, they were prepared. What our principal did right away was put our school counseling team um, on notice to be available and be ready for students who have questions and concerns. During a holiday season that should be filled with hope, messages of hate. Nobody likes to feel targeted or persecuted. So Norfolk police are investigating. A spokesperson said that charges filed would depend on who was responsible and that person's motivation behind the crime. Melanie Woodruff, 10 on your side.